five days ago I made a post in my YouTube channel and all I said is guess what I'm making and you can clearly see that I was making a map for a FPS game that I was going to make a tutorial on and surprise surprise my file got corrupted so I lost my complete project I just can't open it anymore and here I am making a brand new one from scratch I guess you can take this as a first video of a series that I am really looking forward to make and we're gonna make a obviously a first person shooter so in this video this is all we are going to make but as we can see let me make it bigger so this is what we're gonna make uh, this is completely free to download and what we're going to do in this video is change it with a different gun so as we can see we have the gun we can shoot it we have some animations working but not all of them So how are we going to get this character into the scene and these simple mechanics working? So first of all, we are going to go and download this template right here or this uh, asset right here into the asset store. I'll link this down in the video description. And then what we're going to need is some animations for the actual character because that is not included into the FPS asset right here. So go into Mixemo search for rifle and you should see a locomotion somewhere in here this is called rifle eight way locomotion pack and this is basically everything that we are going to need to build our game so download that and the very last thing that is optional to get is the standard asset you should be familiar with the standard asset from the unity assets and that is all that we are going to do so after you get this easy FPS pack, we're going to see a scene right here and we can just hit play into this scene. So this is all we are going to get. We can switch into that new game that I just introduced. And that is okay. That is exactly what we're going to fix right now. So we're going to go into player and we are going to look for guns I have. As we can see, we have a new gun semi and a new gun auto. If you go into the resources right here, we are going to see a new gun auto and a new gun semi. This is the gun that I brought into the scene. So this one right here. You can download this down in the video description as well. And in order to make this new gun semi, all we are going to have to do is just duplicate one of these guns. Like this one, for example, you can just hold control and D. And now we have a new gun auto. If we open up the new gun auto, we're going to see all these components right here. And if we zoom in into that, we're going to see the hands right here. So this is all we are going to need to fix. We're going to go into the FPS, which, which you should find down in the video description as well. We're going to go into weapons. And here is our weapons right here that we can just use. So don't worry about the pink textures. All we're going to do is just drag a assault rifle or maybe we want to do a I don't know a pistol right here so there it is here is our pistol and as we can see it's not very well lined up so you can just line it up right here there we go the pistol currently has a error and I should just fix that okay so now all that's left for us to do is to unpack this prefab disable the old one and that is all that's left for you to do right here so after you drop in your pistol or maybe you want to drop in a assault rifle all you're going to have to do is change this animator right here so in order to change it we're going to see that it already has a animator I'm just going to remove these scripts right here and all we're going to do is drag the pistol and drop it into the animator right here there we go now we have an animator and we are going to need a firing spot or a muzzle flash spot and as we can see it has already been defined right here so we're just gonna have to assign it so here is the muzzle spot we're just gonna drop the muzzle flash effect drop it in here and that is all that's left for you to do now what you can do is just save this prefab and there we go we have a new gun auto one now we're going to copy this name right here we're going to go back into the player and just add in a new object right here so now if we hit play everything is going to be the 
same, obviously. But if we change up, we're going to see that we have a pistol. There we go. Okay, so that is how we are going to make a new pistol into our game. So in the next videos, we are going to make this game just a little bit prettier. And yeah, that is all about today's video. I hope you liked it. I hope you have learned something from it. I will be continuing this series because, because I'm really into the FPS games. And uh, I will see you in the next videos.